Hi everyone, uh, welcome back to aking channel, uh, GTR Math Tutorial. So for today's video, uh, we will discuss another civil service exam word problem. So number 12 na tayo, so sana napanood nyo na ang simula number 1. Okay, so here's the question. Try nyo munang sagutan. So there are some t-shirts of different colors. One-fourth of these are green, one-eighth are blue, one over 12 are yellow, and the remaining 39 t-shirts are white. How many are blue t-shirts? So ang question po na ito ay nanggaling sa ayan sa group na Civil Service Exam 2024. Okay? So ayan yung mga choices natin. Okay? So sagutan na natin. So tandaan kailangan sa Civil Service Exam ay bawat problem doon ay masagutan nyo within uh, one minute dahil oras ang kalaban dito sa Civil Service. So try natin a uh, Padaliin ito, so kung paano nyo sasagutan ito ng 1 minute lang dapat. Okay? So ang question, so how many are blue t-shirts? So inahanap natin yung blue t-shirts, so hindi natin alam yung, yung total, hindi natin alam. So sabi there are some t-shirts of different colors, 1 fourth, 1 fourth of these are green, 1 eighth are blue, 1 over 12 are yellow, and the remaining 39 t-shirts are white. Okay, so hinahanap how many are blue t-shirts. So mag-assign lang muna tayo ng variable dito. So ang sabi, yung apat na shirts daw. So we have green plus blue. And then we have 112 are yellow. And then the remaining are white. So hindi natin alam kung ilan yung total niyan. So green plus blue plus yellow plus white, hindi natin alam. So mag-assign tayo ng variable. So let's say yung variable na gamitin natin ay x. So, depende sa inyo kung ano gusto nyo gamitin. Okay, so, ngayon, uh, buuin na natin ang magiging equation natin. So, sabi ang green daw, one-fourth of these are green. So, kunin natin ang one-fourth ng x. So, we have one-fourth of x. So, pwedeng one-fourth of x, pwede namang x over 4 na lang. Parehas lang din yon. Okay, so, plus, ang blue daw, one-eighth are blue. So, we have one-eighth of x are blue. And then, one over 12 are yellow. So, plus, one over 12 of x are yellow and then the remaining remaining 39 t-shirts are white. So, plus 39 ay equal dapat siya sa x. So, ito na magiging working equation natin dyan. So, ang first step natin sa pag-solve ng ganitong uh, equation dahil may denominator, 4, 8, and 12 kailangan ma-eliminate natin yung denominator by multiplying both sides of the equation by the LCD. So, ano bang LCD ng 4, 8, and 12? So ganyan sa teknik sa ganitong mga problem mag-start tayo sa multiples ng pinakamalaking number. So we have 4 8 12. Start tayo sa multiples ng 12 ng 12. So yung 12 pwedeng ma-divide yung 4, pero yung 12 hindi pwedeng ma-divide yung 8. So ano ang next sa 12? Next sa 12 ay 24. So 24 pwedeng ma-divide ang 8, pwedeng ma-divide ang 4. So therefore ang LCD na to ay 24. So multiply natin both sides of the equation by 24. Okay, so x, ayan, times 24. Then, ang next line natin dito, automatic, wala ng denominator dahil maka-cancel out na yan. So, i-distribute natin itong 24 dito sa apat na terms sa loob ng uh, bracket natin. So, 24 times 1 fourth x, so i-divide lang ito, 24 divided by 4, that is equal to 6. Then, i-multiply natin sa 1x, so that will be 6x. Okay, plus, distribute dito. So, 24 times 1, 8x. So, divide lang. 24 divided by 8. That is equal to 3 times 1x. So, we have 3x. And then, we have plus 24 times 1 over 12x. Or, simply divide 24 divided by 12. That is equal to 2 times 1x. So, we have 2x plus 24 times 39. Okay. So, ang technique sa ganitong mga problem Ang magiging sagot naman dito ay, ay mga choices natin. So, puro integers yan, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So, puro whole numbers. So, para mabilis, mabilis tayong mag-solve, huwag na nating multiply ito. Kasi medyo civil service, bawal ang calculator dyan. So, medyo makakaubos ng oras nyo yung 24 times 39 dahil manual yan. So, ang technique, huwag nyo nang imumultiply yan. Imumultiply yan, lagay nyo lang, 24 times 39. Naka-parenthesis lang muna. Kasi sigurado may maka-cancel dyan. Okay? So, itong right side natin ay 24x. So, i-add lang natin ito. Combine like terms. Itong tatlo. 6x plus 3x plus 2x. So, that is equal to 6 plus 3, 9 plus 2. We have 11x. Plus, 
24 times 39 equals 24x. Then subtract 11x to both sides para pagsamayin si 11x and 24x. So minus 11x minus 11x. So syempre 0 na ito. So we have 24 times 39 equals 24x minus 11x that is equal to 13x. And then para masolve si x, divide natin both sides by 13. Okay? So kita nyo na kaya hindi ko minultiply yung 24 and 39. May, may makakancel. 39 ay pwedeng i-divide sa 13. Okay? So 39 divided by 13, that is equal to 3. So tsaka natin i-multiply, pwede ng emmental, madali na kasi. So therefore, ang x natin ay 24 times 3, so that is equal to 72. So 3 times 4 is 12, and then 3 times 2 is 6 plus 1, so we have 72. So ang hinahanap natin ay blue t-shirts, so ang blue natin ay 18x. So therefore, Ang blue is equal to 18x, so the answer is equal to 18 of 72 or 72 divided by 8. So the number of blue t-shirts is equal to 9. 72 divided by 8 is 9. Therefore, the correct answer is letter D. Okay, so that's it. So thank you for watching and I hope nagustuhan yung explanation ko para sa problem na ito. And kita-kita tayo sa mga susunod pang mga Civil Service Exam uh, Reviewer. So good luck sa lahat na nagre-review. Bye-bye and God bless.